Alright, so we finally made it out on the water and our mission today is to catch some bait. So we've got the Mrs. Parker on the uh, on the rod with uh, little Hunter. As you can see he's already had his zinc fight for the day. And we're, uh, we're just working this little patch here to see if we can find the bait. So stay tuned and I'll get back into it and we'll show you some fish. Say so go mommy, go! We found the fish, look! Good snacking. I'm pregnant. Greg, mommy's gonna find the fish for us. Look, she should. I know. I don't. Then it's oh, look, look at that! Woohoo! Okay. I think that I think that counts as bait. Not too not too tight on that drag. Oh, she's not too tight. How do you go? Where is the fish? He's coming. Oh, okay. Well, there's two that we need and one snapper. It's amazing the variety of fish you catch out here. Oh, oh okay. Oh, you got him? Yep. So you hold that. Oh, okay. And I'll take the You take the <laughs> Okay. So the snapper is not what we're chasing. So he can say bye bye, swim home. Bye bye, buddy. Say bye bye, snapper. We can have this one. These are our yellowtail yakkers, which are perfect bait for us. In the tank. Fish number two. In the tank. Oh, shark. 
No, it wasn't a shark, honey. Woo! There we go. Back out of the top of the bait again. I'm now eating the licorice. And Next time, don't complain about it. Bug has got to get back in the water. Should hopefully hook up. So there we go. Oh yeah. Did that work? Mm-hmm. It's a licorice, mate. I'll it's a licorice. Okay. Licorice. <laughs> That's it. Hey, shark. Nah, no shark today. No shark. One, one swim. Oh. I was gonna say I just watched one lead the boat then. Uh -huh. Oh, up, up, up. Yakka, nice size yakka. Yeah. Oh. Let's pull that rod a bit tighter, honey. Oh. This is fishing and parenting at the same time. It's good. We got it all under control. <laughs> What, what happened? Somebody <laughs> may have got a full string of uh, was... yakkers and, well, you know, <laughs> between juggling fish and kids. At any rate, lassoed in the ass. I got him in the ass anyway. Oh. <laughs> Are you laughing at? <laughs> well, because I caught the fishy in the bottom. In the bottom. In the bottom. And then I hooked you. Didn't take much. You don't need much bait, do you, honey? Whoa, 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 hey. What is it, Baba? Talk about okay. eating yourself in a shit situation. Would you like a hand? Hey. All right, Hunter's filming. We're on Hunter Vision now. Alright, jump out mate, good on ya. Feel good about that? Alright, looks like we may have found the mother load. Fingers crossed. You might not have... Yeah. yeah. You might not even get to the bottom with the way that is. Yep, on. Okay. Yep, on. Nice and smooth. Mm. Nice and smooth. Yeah, back that drag off just a touch. That was tightening. A bit more off. Whoa! This might be a bit better of a fish coming out of that. Oh! oh did you just pop it? Or did it change direction? It changed direction. Oh. Popped itself. All right, drop it back down. That's better. All right, so as promised, I'm gonna show you guys uh, how to find bait. Quite simple, we've got our own little marks, and I won't lie, these marks here, um, we only picked up on today, and it was only the fact that we were uh, moving on through that I decided we'd pull up and stop on these, uh, on these little marks. But as you can see, you've got a little bit of a line there on the bottom where the, uh, the fish are coming through. Oh. And there's there's the bait starting right there so not a, not a lot not a decent patch there but starting to show a little bit more as you've seen through the video they've been a little bit more uh, schooled up but see they're starting to form here that's basically what you're looking for so once we find the bait we try and generally stay in the same area and uh, and just work through it let's see what happens here Having a good fish finder is obviously key, but having an idea of where you should be is also gonna help. See, here comes the bait right there. So if Parker drops, so she's dropping, we should, unless the, oh, look at that, and she's on. And it's as simple as that to find bait, guys. You know, we use these bait for everything from kingfish to tuna to even marlin if you really want to. Um, it's just an awesome thing to be doing. Easy to do, there you go. Nice little yakka, as you've seen before. But that's it, guys. Basically, it's just about finding your spot. 
finding the fish and just keeping them alive in that tank. guys so as I said I was going to show you what we like to use to catch our bait uh, first things first we'll start off with our rod so you can basically use any rod you like I have a rod that I use for a lot of things I use this for my micro jigging as well as my soft plastic work um, but it's also really good for catching bait it's a nice graphite stick nice strong tip uh, easily lifting pretty much every fish that we deal with so it's fantastic um, as you saw the sabiki that we used today got absolutely destroyed with tangles here and missing hooks there so uh, fortunately they are cheap so if you do destroy them it's okay um, we have our sinkers that we use this is probably on the larger side of what we tend to use in that depth of water but there was a bit of current today so you can definitely go down to smaller size sinkers if you need be or in some cases uh, maybe even just float your jig uh, which we do sometimes this is what your jigs look like guys, nice and simple. There's a swivel on the back that you tie into and a clip on the other end that you can just clip straight onto your sinker. Uh, they're not overly expensive. I think these are like three or four bucks each, something like that. Um, and you know, for the results that you get, you can't really go wrong. But there you have it guys. That's basically the gear that we use. Uh, yeah, if you, uh, if you want to see more of, uh, of us catching bait, then uh, we'll definitely do some more videos. But I hope that this, uh, this definitely helps. Um, and gave you guys some advice. At any rate, we'll uh, see you soon. Alright guys, well we're done for another episode. We're uh, heading back into the boat ramp now. Got the family up the front. With these goggle-eyed sunglasses on. At any rate, I hope you guys got something out of this video. I know it wasn't exactly what we normally do, but we did try to show you something a little bit different. We came out here without a plan, but we ended up uh, coming up with something anyway. So, we had fun. The family had fun. Hunter is absolutely wrecked, but uh, that's okay. We enjoyed it, and we'll see you on the next adventure.